Hey guys, it's Marty Geek. In this video, I'm gonna be playing Dragon Quest Builders. This is the demo that was just released today. Uh, today was actually the release of the video for the Nintendo Direct, uh, which was actually a mini Nintendo Direct, which covered a lot of games in like less than 15 minutes. Um, let's go ahead here for a second, let you guys see that you can actually customize your characters here. I could choose female if I want. Um, here I could change the color to whatever color I want. Let's go ahead and choose pink uh, skin. Let's go white and eyes. I could go ahead and choose green. And that's it. Uh, yeah, that's good. I'll leave it like that. Uh, of course, you got a lot of things you could change the settings as well. But here I'm going to go ahead and start from the beginning because I already tried it a little bit so I can get used to the controls a little bit. Uh, this game is not new for the... It is new for the Switch, but it's not a new game. It actually came out, I think it was last year for the Ninten uh, for the PlayStation Vita. And it was actually a very, very popular game. Um, and um, I never got into it, even though I think I downloaded, I downloaded the demo and I tried it out. Never got into it. Never really, really got into it. But it was a very, very popular game. So here I'm just going to be skipping all the conversations. So excuse me if you don't like that. There you go. So we wake up here in this little dungeon here, and we need to, of course, escape this. So, of course, the this first section is basically going to be like a little tutorial showing you how to uh, use uh, the controls and all that, how to move around and jump. Let me see that right there. Yeah, jump. Okay. Da -da -da -da. So, yeah, while, while I'm trying to play this game, <laughs> skipping and skipping and skipping, I'm going to try to to talk about some of the games that I liked uh, that was announced in the at the mini direct that was available. And it's also available right now if you want to watch it on your Nintendo Switch, of course, you um, just go ahead right here, right there. And it's right there, that video right there. You go ahead and try it out. Um, so... Okay, let's go ahead and cut damn it. It's a lot of talking. I hate when these games forces me to to do all, all the talk all the tutorials Even though I already did it get okay, healing create healing there bum, bum, as a potion So now oh another thing here you can actually control the camera and it's really cool because you can actually get onto the character right there focus really well if you want some people like to have the character right on, you know, right on. So here, if I want to use that, there you go. Voila, there you go. Look how beautiful. Wait a second, I thought it was a, is this the girl? Or is this the guy, the same one that I had before? I think this is the same guy. I thought I changed. I guess I didn't save it. I guess I didn't save it. Something I did wrong, but I'm pretty sure I chose the, the girl. And I got the same boy that I started trying before. Huh. So, like I said, I'm going to try and talk a little bit of the games that was announced. I'm not going to mention every single one of them because I'm not going to remember. Uh, but some of the ones that I really liked, like, for example, the Mario, the new Mario Tennis game. Um, I liked it because it also has like a little story mode as well, like a campaign mode. Uh, it looks really nice. Uh, the graphic looks really awesome. Um, of course, Mario looks amazing. Uh, Nintendo does a great job creating Mario games and making that making him look amazing on every new game. So that the that game actually looks pretty good. You pl you play. In, there's a story mode as well, um, and you go through the story. You go to different locations. You fight v different bosses. Uh, it's really nice, and I. I'm surprised that that game is actually coming out in the first half of the year uh, this spring. I don't remember if it actually had a release date. You know what? I don't. I don't really think. I think it was. Yeah, I think it was confirm confirming the comments or not. I think the game was actually confirmed for the first half of the year, spring. Because I'm saying spring because almost every single game on the direct was announced in between now and summer. So that's pretty cool. So here, of course, I'm going to go ahead and equip that little thing that I just got, the cypress stick. There you go. So when you get a weapon, like an axe or something like that, that's how you also switch between weapons as well. 
So that game, I'm definitely going to pick it up. I like sports game, especially sports game like that, you know, like Mario, Mario one. Honestly, in my opinion, the, the, the sports game that I really, 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 really wanted for to come on the Switch was the, the Mario uh, Golf game. Uh, the Nintendo Golf game that came out, I think, uh, years ago on the, on the 3DS. I want that game to be uh, uh at least if it's not that game a remastered game to come to the nintendo switch that i would love to see what am i supposed to do here okay yeah i gotta gather some things over here blocks so i can go ahead and build some steps yeah that's the game that i really wanted to see uh, for the Nintendo Switch, it, it, even if it was a remastered one, I don't care if it was a new one or a remastered one. That's the game that I really wanted to see on the Nintendo Switch because I like, I like playing golf games on the Switch, and I think that golf game on the Switch with all the Nintendo characters would have been awesome to play on the Nintendo Switch. But well, we got the Mario Tennis, which it still looks great as well. Um, Oh, God damn it, I put blocks everywhere except where I have to. <laughs> um, the other game, Hyrule Warrior. That's a game that I, when I saw it on the Nintendo 3DS, I was almost going to buy it, but I didn't buy it because I, uh, cause of the reviews. It got I didn't get re really good reviews because of the... There you go, let's get out of here. It didn't get good reviews. If I'm not mistaken, it was because of the frame rate issues. It was like a mess when a lot of characters on the screen. And, you know, that defeats the purpose because that's the type of game um, Hyrule Warrior is. It's like a hack and slash Dynasty Warrior type of game. Um, and um, I think on the, on the 3DS, it had bad reviews because of that when it first came out. I don't know if it actually got fixed later on. Uh, with a patch or not, let me know in the comments. But that was the reason why I didn't play it, even though I did have a 3DS. Um, now it's coming for the Switch, and it looks really damn good. I think, if I'm not mistaken, they actually said that it's going to be running 1080p, 60 frames per second in console mode, and TV mode. I think that's what I heard. Um, and in mobile mode, it looks incredible. You can actually play it with separate Joy-Cons as well, to um, in co-op as well. It looks really damn nice. I think they did a great job, and it's going to be a very, very good port. Because remember, everything that came out on Wii or 3DS will play perfectly good on the Nintendo Switch. Um, another game that uh, they announced was the Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong actually got a lot of love in this uh, Nintendo Direct. Because um, first, um, they announced a DLC for Donkey Kong in Mario Plus Rabbids which is one of my favorite games of last year um that game is amazing i think it's awesome and it's great that it has a whole bunch of nintendo characters in it and now we're gonna get donkey kong i don't know if there's actually gonna be like a story related to him or he's just gonna be another character added that you can use i hope it's actually a story too you know i hope there's a, an extended story for donkey kong and it looks really good. So I can't wait to try that out. I think that's coming out soon. And the other thing, the other game, the reason that I'm saying that it got a lot of love is because not only did it get announced for a DLC, it actually getting, we're actually getting a Donkey Kong Freeze. I think it's Donkey Kong Freeze. Um, that game is another game that I remember when it came out on, uh, I think, I don't remember if it was on 3DS or was it on, nope, don't switch to that, or was it on Wii U? I can't remember. Let me know in the comments. I don't know if it was on Wii U or 3DS, but Donkey Kong Freeze um, is coming out. It looks really good. I, you know, I like platforming games and that platforming game actually looks pretty good i think if i'm not mistaken i've heard before that it's a hard game uh but i don't know it looks really good so i think that's the i'm gonna definitely pick it up because it looks really good and i never played that game so for me for me it's gonna be a new game so for her i i think i have to build a new house right what do you want Planted the flag. What do you? I 
Okay, so I gotta fix her house. Yeah. So yeah, Donkey Kong Freeze uh, is actually coming out for the Switch, and I think, I think it's only gonna be available. No, I think it's also gonna be available this spring as well, which is awesome too. That is good to know. Nope. Oh crap. Yeah, I messed this up. There you go. Gonna fix the walls. Uh, what other game came out? So yes, I'm definitely gonna be picking up on um, Donkey Kong, and I think I'm gonna be picking up Donkey Kong on both, on you know, on both games: the Mario Plus Rabbit game and, um, oops, Mario Plus Rabbit and the standalone game. Yes, I think I'm gonna pick pick it up both. And um, the other game, of course, they didn't talk about Bayonetta, which is kind of weird. But I, I think you know, they want to give more chance, more time for the new games they they haven't announced. Uh, but they actually announced, you know, they actually talked about the, they actually showed us a little trailer for um, for um, how do you call it? Payday, Payday Two. Which is also coming out for the Nintendo Switch. They actually showed us that too. And it's really cool. I think they added a new character. Mick. Okay. I think they added a new character as well. And it looks really damn good. Okay. I think the new character that they added is called Joy. Because um, there's a teaser trailer that came out, and um, there's this female hacker. She looks like a hacker. She's working on a computer, and she builds, she like customizes a digital mask. And the mask, when she puts it on, it says Joy. So I don't know if that's her actually name. I think it is. I think it is her actual name. I'm gonna build here. I'm gonna build the torch. There you go. There you go. Ha 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 ha. Make. Good. So you can see that it looks really damn good. This game actually looks really damn good. And right now I'm using the third. Oh, this that was the second camera. The third one actually focuses a little bit more on the camera. And look at that. That looks really damn good. This is the first one. This is the second one. I prefer to use the second one because the second one looks, uh, the character looks big, but you can still see the whole world around you. Uh, when you use the third one, it's actually just focus on your character. So there you go. We got her room ready. There you go. There you go. I got her house done. Hey girl, I ready to build your house. Did you see it? Yes, quest complete. Ha ha! There you go. So, what else? What else did they announce that I really liked? Uh, Kirby? Uh, Kirby Stars something. I forgot the third name. Uh, that game actually looks very good too. It looks really, really nice. I, I remember playing Kirby back in the day uh, on the 3DS and it was a really nice game. Uh, of course, there's a whole bunch of Kirby games uh, and a lot of them are hardcore, you know, like hard platform. Uh, most of them I think they're really easy because they're tailored more for young um, players but it's a really nice beautiful game um and the one that they showed up they showed on the uh direct actually looks really nice too it has really nice colors uh the platforming looks really cool so you know since i also like platforming i might try that game and it's also coming out this spring as well which is really awesome um and uh, the last game that they announced of course i'm skipping some games but the last game that they really announced, which I think it was a surprise, I didn't ex expect them to announce it, uh, was um, uh, Dark Souls, Dark Souls Remastered. Uh, that game 
is confirmed for the Nintendo Switch. And I think, I think it's actually coming out this summer. Not spring, but I think it's actually going to come out this summer. Um, am I going to pick it up? I don't think so. I don't know if I'm going to pick it up or not because I've never been a, a Dark Souls fan. Never liked it. I don't like the, I mean, you know, I'm really bad on those games. I just can't stand it. Um, I'm really, I'm just really bad playing Dark Souls games. Um, and I don't think I'm going to pick it up, even though it's going to be, you know, available for the Switch on the go. Maybe I'll try it out and make a video for you guys. You know, most likely I will pick it up and make a video for you guys. Let me know if you do want to see gameplay for that, because if you do, there's a lot of people requesting some gameplays. I will go ahead and pick it up and make some videos for you guys. Uh, but, yes, that game, I think uh, it's, you know, one of the biggest game announced. But uh, that, that game is old. I think that game, isn't that the first Dark Souls game? Because I think that game is old as hell. Uh, I don't know which one is older. Is it Skyrim or Dark Souls? Which game is older? I don't know. I'm going to have to... Ch I'm going to have to Google it <laughs> right after I finish this video. Uh, but, yeah, that game is going to come out. I don't know. They didn't really show no gameplay at all. They just sh showed a little teaser video, and that's it. Uh, so, we don't really know how that game is going to play on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, but, yeah, you know, the fact that it's actually coming to the Nintendo Switch and it's a remastered one, I think it's really cool. I think it's really cool. Um, let me see. I think there wasn't. There was another game that was announced. It was like a fighting game uh, with females. That game looked cool. That game looked really, really cool. It was like a, a 2D uh, fighting game. I can't remember. I can't. SNK something. I can't remember. Let me see. Let me see right here. Let's go ahead. Excuse me. We got that. Uh, we got uh, Dark Souls. We got Wondrous uh, Mario Plus Rabbits, which I already showed you guys. Uh, this one right here, SNK Heroines. That game looks really good. That game looks really, really good. Uh, we got a JRPG, YS, that one. Uh, we also got Harry Roller, which I already talked about. Um, DLC for Pokemon Tournament looks really cool. Oh, and the uh, DLC for uh, Luigi. Luigi, I think, Balloons for Super Mario Odyssey. Uh, another DLC actually coming out, I think, uh, very soon as well. So, yeah, um, that game looks really cool. I don't know what am I supposed to do here because this is the last. All right. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know what I agreed to there. <laughs> okay, Rika. Okay. Okay. So, I'm going to be ending the video here because uh, it's getting long and I just, you know, I just wanted to talk a little bit of the, about the Nintendo Direct and show you guys a little bit of the demo for Dragon Builders. This game is actually going to come out on February 9th. So, if you like these type of games, I think you're not going to be disappointed. Uh, it looks great on the uh, playing this game on the go on this big screen compared to other devices, you know. Um, I think it's going to be a good port. To the nintendo switch in and it actually moves really damn good it actually moves really damn good so i don't think there's gonna be any disappointments look at that looks really good it has like it, I, honestly i think if you like like um minecraft and dungeon crawler games and i think you this is game is perfect for you because it has like a lot of you know the minecraft elements like you know gathering stuff and destroying stuff and gathering blocks and all that looks really cool looks really cool but you know like i said uh, later on i'm gonna be uploading another video for a new game that i it caught my eye i think it's called fury so guys thanks for watching the video let me know what did you like from the nintendo direct uh, which was a small di Nintendo Direct, but it was really good. I, in my opinion, it was really good Nintendo Direct. So, let me know, guys. Thanks for watching the video. Till next time.